this is Tanu, your online dance and workout instructor. This is video 3 of our 10 video series of moves inspired by sports. And today's sports are medieval sports. Huh, what is that? Well, actually sports number 1 is like horseback riding, or we're going to pretend we are a little horse. Sports number 2 is archery, okay? And lastly, Sports number three is everything like sword related, like we are a knight. All right, so before we start, as always, make sure your area is clear and safe, and we are ready to get started with our warm up with music. Here we go. All right, so you got the gesture. We're gonna do a big yes with our heads a couple times, and a big no. Again, a big yes. And a big no. Beautiful. And shoulders up and down. And two. And three. And four. And with our whole torso. Three. And four. And I don't know. With your shoulders and hands. Two. Three. Four. Beautiful. And Let's try with the other leg up. Here we go. 
carving. Here we go. And a beautiful horse here. Beautiful. And we'll come back. Let's do that one more time on this side. And one, and two, and three, and four. And last time. And one, and two, and three, and four. Beautiful. Horse is safe. Beautiful. All right. So now we are just going to be galloping. Our horse just wants to run and run and run like it's free running on a beautiful beach. Okay, here we go. What happened to my music? All right, mystery. All right, here we go. We got a horse and we're galloping really fast. Hands, I mean, all legs together. Six, seven, and woo, woo, woo. Jumpy, jumpy and galloping. All right, let's go faster. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Beautiful. All right. Let's move on to our second medieval sport, which is archery. Okay, so now I want you to imagine that you're holding a bag uh, full of um, arrows. All right. So for that, so you see how those bags are like kind of on, on sideways here. Imagine you have that. You're carrying that nice bag over here and then suddenly, whew, you hear something, you need to grab your arrow and bring it to the front. Let's do that with both arms. So we're here, one and two, and then one and two. And one, you twist, come back, you twist, you twist, Bring it forward, twist, bring it forward. One and two, and one and two, and one and twist. And last time, here we go. Very good. This time you really need to focus on, um, on your target, okay? So here we go, you have your arc. Imagine you're holding your arc. Here your legs are gonna be slightly open, kind of like this, all right, slightly open. And you have your beautiful arm that you have to oh, hold, hold, hold. So here, twist your body on the side. Oh, you can look at the target if you want. Am I okay? Am I okay? And if, when you're ready to let the arrow go, you both, I mean, that, that would technically be incorrect, but I mean, it's a dance. Why not? You let go both of your fingers wide open and come back. Let's try on the other side. So here, I have my arm. Extend, extend, extend. A nice fist here, both hands. On the count of three, we're gonna let that fist go. One, two, three. And come back, and again. And one, and two, and come back. And then one, and two, and come back. A couple four more times. And come back, and one, and come back. Excellent. What happened to my music? Goodness, it's not working with me today. So, um, now we are trying to dodge the arrows. Imagine your arrows coming at you, you don't know why, but you need to dodge them, to escape them, okay? So, let's pretend you need to go down, down, up, up, and up again, and down. shape, an H shape, horizontal H shape, 
with your whole body. And a one, and a two, and a one, and a two, and slightly faster. Two, one, two, and then smooth, smooth, a up, and a one, and a two, and a one, and a two, and a one. Beautiful. All right, let's move on to the other sword move, which now you are a knight during a battle. Okay, keep one of your hands here on your shoulder, feet kind of slightly bent but with an opening here, and you're carrying your sword here. You're really nice and squatted here with a nice straight back, and we're gonna go front, 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 and back, 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 and front, 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 and back, 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 again, and one, and a two, and a three, and a four, and switch, other side. Ready, knights? Let's go in front. One, and back, and front, and back. Couple more, let's go in one, and two, and last time. All right, great, 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 great job, everyone. So we already learned our moves uh, from the horse, from, um, what was the second one, the archery, and the sword, okay? So now let's take one move from each medieval sport and make a small sequence out of it. Let's take from the horse, let's take galloping. So galloping with our arms and legs. From the archery, let's do the escaping, dodging the arrows, all right? And from the sword, let's do, um, oh, I forgot one for the sword. I'm so sorry, I forgot one move for the sword. Let me teach you that and we're gonna do that in our combo. Here we go. Our last sword uh, movement was inspired by Excalibur. Do you know the legend of Excalibur, the legend of Arthur and Excalibur? That's the sword that is stuck in a rock that nobody, even the strongest of men and women in um, the whole uh, kingdom could not take that sword out until Arthur came and had magical power and could take that sword out of the rock, right? So we're gonna pretend we have this heavy, heavy sword stuck here in the rock. All right, and we're gonna try to pull it once and twice and three and four, five, the fifth time is gonna be the right one. Fifth, it comes out of the rock. You're gonna swing it, swing it and swing it, swing it on top of you, all right? So five times pulling it out, trying. Fifth time is the right time and you swing into a nice kind of rotating shape. So let's add these three movements in a, in a short sequence. Here we go, we're galloping, five, six, seven, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, you got the arrows and go down and up and up and up and one more time and two and three last time and then down and up and dodge and dodge and do the and two and three and four one last time and five beautiful swing 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 and swing 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 excellent we did it all right, I lost my memory a couple of times, but we finally were able to finish this video. In any case, I hope you enjoyed learning about those um, moves that are inspired by medieval sports. Um, you can make mix and match your own moves, obviously, create your own combo. You have way more imagination than I do, I am sure. I really look forward to see what you come up with, and I'll see you in the next video, in video four. Hmm, what, what sports could that be this time? Let me think about it a little longer. All right, until next time, bye-bye. Hello, this is Tanu. If you enjoy my videos, please like, share, and subscribe on the channel. And don't forget to send me your own requests, ideas, and suggestions. Thanks.